Okay, we are going to do our practice. Um, you should be checking your work if possible, um, making sure that you understand um, and that the answers that you put in were correct. Uh, put in last name, first name, class period, and we are going to do some with rise over run. I gotta move my face out of the way, so I'll be over here today. Maybe. So rise over run, I'm going to think about this one. It is probably negative because it's going downhill. I'm going to rise one, two, three, four. So that is up four, positive four. And then I'm going to run one, two, but it's backwards two. So rise over run would be positive four over negative two. So you're going to type that answer in there, 4 over negative 2, and that should be that problem. We will click quickly correct this one. I'm going to think again, rise, 1, 2, so that's up 2, and then run, 1, 2, 3, 4, five, six. So the rise was two, the run was six, which is two over six. And my instructions say do not reduce, do not reduce the fraction, because yes, that could be one, one over three. Um, but in this case, because I want to make sure that my answers are correct, don't reduce the fraction. We'll go on to the next problem and do the same thing. Rise of a run, this one looks like it is positive because it is a, going uphill. Rise is one, two, three, four. My run is one, two. So this is plus four plus two. So rise over run would be four over two. Four over two. The next one, let's see if I can get two to fit in one page. Does not look like I can, but we'll try. All right, this one is downhill. So negative one, two, three, four, five, six. So negative six over, we're going to do the run, which is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So negative six over seven. Negative six over seven. Uh, that one is a straight line, so it has no slope. It's going um, that way, so my slope is zero. Looking at this one right here, up and down slope. That means there's no hill whatsoever. It is a cliff. Your answer is undefined. Now, assuming I did everything right, we will have a good score, 10 out of 12. So let's see, I may have counted something wrong. Yeah, it looks like I might have counted. So let's check. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, Miss Began was right. This would be negative five over seven. So I am assuming that you guys are watching the whole video. Uh, so this, and it's over six. Uh-oh. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes, Miss Began was totally wrong, but the answers that are in there for you to do should be right. So you need to have made sure that you watch this video the whole way through. It's only four minutes. You can take it. 